I will let you know when it is gone. It pretty much is. Okay. I, I just, I, I love, I love this design. Oh, Done. me too. I love dragonflies, first of all. And, this and is, I love it, how playful he is. It's just such a yeah. perfect, sweet, yes. special, mm. wonderful new piece. I, I think this is a big future for you, Victoria. I think you should start doing more brooches. I think you should start doing more. I mean, you told me you paint. I this do. Is, I love to paint. Yes. This is, mm -hmm. this is painting and jewelry. Yes. It's a stunning, mm -hmm. beautiful piece of artwork. It's got that beautiful cultured freshwater pearl drop. It's brand new today, so it's on a special introductory price. $10 off. It's on special flex for the holidays. It's only $18 and it is a wonderful universal choice to make whether you love the symbology of the dragonfly or you simply yeah. just love the, the artistic nature of this piece because it's right. beautiful. Yeah, dragonflies and uh, dragonflies were the number one motif that the uh, Art Nouveau <laughs> artists actually painted. Um, don't know why, you know, but it's it's when you look at art new. If in fact right now, if you're next to like a, um, a your mobile device, you can Google Art Nouveau and you'll find that the first image that's going to come up is going to be something like a, uh, a dragonfly. It's just a beautiful, beautiful um, you know creature. It's people have been always mystified by what a dragonfly is, um, but art. Deco period also, you see a lot of, you know, so if you're somebody who likes history, who likes art, um, I love this. I mean, I would love to wear this like next to a black. I mean, what I would wear, I would wear it with, with what I have on right now. And I, my sample, I didn't want to have to put it on, on me, but it's a gorgeous piece. And it's just like, you know, carrying like this little treasure that it picked up somewhere, which is your pearl. So you have that pearl. Again, this bro uh, 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 Valerie, if you can, uh, please model for us because it's going to look so they're, they're stunning. Putting, they're on putting her. it on her right mm -hmm. now. They've got to make sure not to pull her hair or poke her. So they're going real fast. I'll get her up here in just a second. Yeah, I want to point to what we talked about mm -hmm. about the wings. Mm -hmm. That it is like stained glass. It's not. It's not heavy. It's not dark enamel. Right. It has a, a natural play. You're going to see it. From, we're going to show it from the back of it too because you're going to actually see the. Um, yeah, I think that was your job. <laughs> So if you guys can come really close, you're going to see this is the back of the dragonfly. And you can see how it is not a flat piece. So if you are, you know, somebody who likes things that are artistic, I mean, at Christmas time, you want to wear something red? Wear this piece. It's gorgeous. And then even his body is mm -hmm. all texturized. So uh, my frustration with this is when you get really close, you're going to see his body is all... The metal underneath it is all texturized. Here we go. Look now you can that. take you can a see look the and artistry see. on mm -hmm. this. And so this is just very delicate, gorgeous piece. I love it. You know, uh, sometimes we we can we can talk and we can show and we can just sometimes I think we just stop and show a beautiful piece of art. You know, whether yeah. you want to mm -hmm. wear it on a on a handbag, whether you want to wear it. You on know, designed scarf. on a yeah. scarf. Mm -hmm. It's just, it's special, it's beautiful. Uh, just very quickly, just to give everybody an update, uh, thank you for your calls and your orders. Our Tanzanite bracelet is now sold out. We do have a wait list available if you're still on the phone asking about it. Um, this is, you know, Victoria really has jam-packed these hours as, as yeah. very close to her end of the year celebration. So if you see something that you love, we offer flex pay, we offer uh, extended holiday returns till the end of January. If you're thinking about gift giving, you can shop with comments. Confidence. Victoria's pieces are very special, and I really do think this celebrates um, your love of art, um, your experiences with travel, and then even your belief in balance, because to show something that's a, a critter, but it still has a very balanced look and feel to it. Right, and this one, again, it's, it's highly artistic. I, I love the artistic pieces, because that's what Art Nouveau period was all about. You know, artists were most creative in, in the history of all mankind. Artists in all walks of life, you know, we're talking about people who designed furniture, textiles, who painted, uh, who made jewelry. The Art Nouveau period, you know, it uh, kind of sort of went out of fashion because they were so ornate and they were going so crazy and people craved, you know, something a little bit more refined and that's when they went to the Art Deco period. So you're looking, a lot. and also the, the history became much more mechanized because they were inventing a lot more machines. But Art Nouveau period, every piece was done to express that artist feeling, and there was only one made. Uh, there was never anything mechanized during the Art Nouveau period. Mm. So this is a dragonfly. An artist might have seen a dragonfly like this, just you know, in his garden or something, and would sketch it out, and they would make that, and they would take this the same, you know, something like this that's the same uh, symbol, and they would put it on their furniture. They would put it on the, you know, their little wings or you know, uh, on their clothing. So, and of all the Art Nouveau period pieces, 
the uh, butter, the dragonfly was the one that almost every artist had their own rendition of dragonfly. So if you're somebody who likes history, you like museums, or you just like things that are pretty, but we find, again, a lot of times, you, you pointed this to earlier, sometimes when you look at critter pieces, they're very big, clunky, they're kind of fun for the moment. These are timeless pieces. These are pieces that you collect, you know, when you travel and you want to have something distinctive. I mean, I would love to wear something like this, just all black, cashmere, and you just have this one piece right next to a scarf. It would be that stunning accent to what you're doing. You so know? I'm, I'm trying to find a, a matching ring. That's just so oh, beautiful and special. Uh, this is our one. Fire Opal ring. Uh, it's very limited. It's last call on it. I'll put an item number at the bottom of the screen for you to take a look. Uh, it's been one of Victoria's runaway hot as fire sellers this season. So uh, you can ask about that. It is a uh, last call on it. It's a perfect, beautiful color, um, you know, style coordinator with this, with this brooch. But you know, I just think for those of you that love to gift jewelry, for those of you that love to find a new piece for the holiday season, we don't, I think most women don't have a lot of brooches. They don't have right. the, the mm. opportunity. You know, I feel like it's that the man wears the pocket square and the woman wears the brooch. It's something that really can take yes. anything mm -hmm. and turn it into something put, stunning and, and eye-catching. Put it on a scarf, put it on, you know, like you said, like, you know, I love to have like a little, when I'm going out to Europe especially, I'll have like a little scarf, in, you know, like um, tied to my handbag. And you can put it there on a hat, for instance, mm. or even a you know, beautiful little uh, sweater set. For, you know, to go to church mm -hmm. with. And when I, you know, for the, I, I go to church every Sunday that I'm home, and when I do, I'm so attracted to stained glass windows. I'm so, you know, because I just think that